Hannaford is a supermarket chain in the Northeast. We have about 188 stores currently. Efficiency Vermont is Vermont's statewide energy efficiency utility. One of the most engaged customers is Hannaford, primarily because their structure is really set up to support efficiency projects. A critical element of Hannaford's commitment and success to its investment in efficiency and its coordination with Efficiency Vermont is there being an overall Hannaford Brothers Energy Department. Our plan is to run the most efficient stores we can. We're able to influence the decisions that are made in other areas. Our projects financially are very competitive with other projects within the company. We can advocate for more energy efficient equipment in the new stores and in the remodels, bringing them down to a four-year ROI or less. When we come up with our measures of what we're going to do, we work with partners like Efficiency Vermont, go out and, and test one of them. Their ability to learn and adapt and try to really fine tune their process is just really impressive. Some of the projects that we've been doing in Vermont include replacing our case lights to LEDs. We'll also do main sales lighting and peripheral lighting upgrades to LED as well with motion sensors. We've been putting zero energy glass doors on the refrigerated cases to contain all the cold air. We connect a glycol heat exchanger to our refrigeration rack and instead of putting all the heat that comes out of the refrigeration equipment up to the rooftop condensers, we're actually extracting the heat from there, transferring to a glycol that goes into our rooftop air handlers and using that to reheat the store 10 or 12 months a year. An example of where Hannaford's is taking a leadership role is participating in Efficiency Vermont's Deep Energy Retrofit Program, where one of their stores located in Brandon, Vermont, is committed to reducing its energy use by 50% by the end of this year. The Brandon store was very inefficient the way it was built. We have a very high electorate bill compared square footage-wise to the rest of the company. We're on target to hit our goal. We've made a lot of strides with the electric goal first. So once we get into the things like the case doors, replacing cases, doing some of the HVAC upgrades, doing a heat reclaim project, we'll start getting more of the fuel savings in that store as well. I think the influence that Brandon has had is moving on to other stores too. Uh, we've got a store in Enosburg that's using a lot of the same um, ideas and principles in their store. When they make that investment and we help them on the financial side as well as the technical and the engineering side, that those savings go right back into the bottom line. And in many cases, customers are able to take those savings and use them to invest in their next generation of project. People just love shopping there now. It, the store seems cleaner and brighter. There is a ripple effect throughout the community. Different customers and even associates have came to me and talked about how they're, they're actually doing more in their own home. I think that some of our projects, while not designed to be sales improvements, I think will actually have sales gains in many of our stores from our energy projects as an extra benefit. It really is just good business.